This week on C Plus News Time, another mockumentary series is headed to network TV, ABC's Freeform is getting like totally serious about comedy, and Elizabeth Banks wants to make you laugh with her hoo-ha. Part of me got a little turned on by that. I hope I turned you on with this. C Plus News Time. It's C Plus News Time with your host, Chad White. Welcome back to C Plus News Time. I'm your host, Chad White, and this is the comedy news I didn't know about for the week of April 4th, 2016. If I was a girl, I think I'd be the fat friend. Let's get right into the news. First up, Fox wants to get famous, mockumentary style. After the overload of mockumentary shows in the past couple of years, Fox is hoping to get on that train with a straight-to-series show, Famous. The show comes from Moesha's Ralph Farquhar and Ty Hodges. The story follows a young couple, Fred the screenwriter and Geneva the pop diva, the latter of who attains stardom overnight, which eventually causes problems for their relationship. The mockumentary part kicks in as the couple attends couples therapy sessions. Famous will premiere on June 12th at 9 p.m. Next up, Freeform, or what used to be called ABC Family, is doing a bit of restructuring. With shows like Pretty Little Liars and Melissa and Joey going off the air and a name change to the network as a whole, they've decided to bolster their continued efforts as a basic cable channel by throwing money to a whole bunch of new shows. Case in point, they've picked up projects from The Lonely Island, Daily Show Producers, and Elizabeth Banks. The Lonely Island show is called Alone Together, and it follows a young man man and woman who grew up in different ways of life as they live life in Los Angeles while staying strictly platonic. Daily Show producers Jennifer Flans and Elise Terrell are bringing Later Bitches, an after-hours, half-hour talk show. It'll be hosted by some funny ladies, although we don't know who. The show is said to redefine late night with celeb interviews, viral videos, and debates. Boy, those sure are unique aspects. And Elizabeth Banks is new show is called Page One, but Page is spelled as Page, the name. Banks will serve as EP to the single camera comedy. The story is about a children's book author who hates children, whose brother brings his two daughters to live with her. Again, totally original. And finally, speaking of Banks, she has another adventure under her skirt. It's her hoo-ha-ha. The comedian co-founded a new comedy platform that will have its sights on funny women. Hoo-ha-ha's mission is to cover every woman, no matter how young or old, famous or not. Female creators will get their media, whatever it may be, seen by a wider audience. It even says Elizabeth herself will head into the depths of the internet to find these women. Banks also added that she hopes that the site will cater to rising talents stating, I really try to have personal relationships with a lot of these women. She goes on to say that she and her production company will be doing some mentoring as well. hoo new site is live right now. And that's all the news I have for you for this week on C Plus News Time. Why don't you check out my hoo by subscribing and liking one of our other videos. As always, you can head to the website cpluscomedy.com where we've got the latest news, reviews, features, interviews, and other good comedy bits that only I can provide you with. As always, you can follow us on Twitter at C Plus Comedy. Follow me on Twitter at Chad Black White. Like us on Facebook. Tumble with us on Tumblr. And ladies, if you're going to be showing your hoo ha to anybody, why not show it to me, a licensed hoo ha physician, MD.